Billy was hiding out in an abandoned farm near Stinkin' Springs. I threw in with the kid because the man I had sworn vengeance on was riding with Billy's enemies. But before I tell you why I want that some bitch dead, let me tell you what happened that day. I was heading back to the hideout when suddenly I had this funny feeling. Funny, haha? -ha? No, Steve. The other kind of funny. You heard that. We need to stay here and keep an eye on the road. That's not fair. We're missing all the fun. I knew those two morons would never let me through. I had no choice. Help! Shoot that some bitch! Was it Pat Garrett's posse? Oh yeah. I heard the shots and I knew I had to move fast. Garrett and his army of deputies had surrounded the entire homestead. I decided to help Billy and the boys out of it. So that's just what I did. As the governor of New Mexico was paying for the kids' apprehension, Garrett was able to hire every gun hand in Lincoln County. I knew that going through that front door meant putting my butt in a shooting gallery, so I decided to get sneaky. Garrett's men were running around like Come a bunch on. of chickens Let's with their heads cut off. Bitches running. turkey shoot from up there. Luckily, these shooters Garrett hired weren't the sharpest tools in the shed. A lot of them were saddle tramps, or sod busters, or drunken drifters looking to make a few bucks. I heard a friendly voice yelling at me from the window. Back door! We'll cover you! Watch your blood! Truth be told, things weren't much better behind the house. Damn you! I cut their numbers in half. But that just made the ones that were left twice as mad. They made up for their lack of skill with a seemingly endless supply of ammo. It was a bit of a slog, but I finally fought my way around the back of the house. Like that, you I was inside, dead, none the worse for wear. I passed Dirty Dave, and upstairs I found Billy and Get Charlie in Bolton. A rat in a trap.
Billy looked at me and said, About time, amigo. Grab a gun and get to the window. Wait, so you were friends with Billy the Kid? Yeah, sort of. Anyway, we were surrounded by dozens of deputized shooters who wanted to do us harm. You Garrett's men were dropping like flies, but they just kept on coming. Uh, 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 Where the hell Garrett get? when Charlie got hit. They're catching us in a crossfire, shouted Billy. Get to the other side! Maybe discretion was the better part of valor. What's that mean? It means that it was time to cut and run. They got a gallon, Billy shouted. Get the horses and bring them round back. I'll draw their attention. Oh, oh, sons of he directed are that order at me. And I thought, why the hell do I have to do it? Many would have fled in my place. But I had that false sense of invincibility that many young men have. Like Jack here. What are you saying, old man? <laughs> Jack is just joshing with you. Yeah, he better be. Mr. Graves, please continue. Please, call me Silas, ma'am. Now, uh, where was I? You were heading for the barn. What a cut you, boy! Oh, 